previously on RL Graph. I love watching these towers blow up. It's such a great thing. Are you proud of me now, chat? Striking Vitality 1, Unbreaking 3, and Advanced Protection 1? What? If this episode doesn't get 100 likes, I will put ketchup in my cereal. What is up, everyone, and welcome back to episode 10 of RL Craft. We hit double digits. We hit double digits. And also, I just, I, I didn't think about this, but like, we need a name for this guy. We haven't named our wolf. So, I'm gonna leave it up to you. Um, leave a comment down below as to what you think we should name this guy. In this episode, I'm gonna get him some diamond armor, and we're gonna enchant it, and he's gonna be a beast. And you guys are gonna name him. And whenever you decide to name him, in a future episode, we will pop a name tag on this boy. So, I'm excited about that. Don't know why I just slashed my sword near him. That was dumb. Anyways, um, in this episode, we need XP, right? Hi. Yeah, um... Oops, let's put, put you away. Uh, in this episode, we need XP. So, we're gonna build a Zaffin farm. We're gonna make an XP farm with Zaffins. So we've got some redstone on us, we've got some levers, we've got unimportant stuff. Two dispensers, um, redstone torches, and... Yeah, really don't need much. Two buckets of lava and a bucket of water. Um, so I was thinking I kind of wanted to be slightly out of sight. I don't, I don't know what I was thinking, to be honest. But we're going to make the kill room over here, so that way... Should we make this the kill room? I cleared this out right before the episode. Just so we can, like, make this into the room where we kill stuff and store things. It's kind of cool. So maybe I was thinking... I was thinking, like, right here would be where the Zappin spawn. But if we did that, then the water would have to come from over here. This is gonna take a second, but real quick guys, I have two things I wanted to let you know about. Oh, the creepers blew this up. I need to fix this as well. So while we go get some dirt, I have two things I want to let you guys know about. First up is we have a Discord in the description down below, full of lots of cool people. Not many people from the channel that are subscribed have joined the Discord, and it would really make my day if you guys did, so you can like hang out, talk to people. I've got a lot of cool people in there already. Got a lot of people that like anime, like Minecraft, like, do I not have any dirt? Okay, I was gonna say. Like talking about video games and just life and stuff, you know? So yeah, we have a Discord. Also, I feel like I don't push this enough because I don't want to push it too much. But we also have channel memberships now. So you can have like special roles in Discord and you can have a special little denomination symbol by your name in the comments. And you can also use um, exclusive channel emotes that are that are in work right now. I'm actually working on getting an artist to help us make those emotes. But there are different tiers for supporting the channel and all the money that you do put into those tiers goes right back into the channel. Or this is fine. For making the channel a better place and making better content. So I'm excited to announce that. I really haven't made a video about channel memberships yet. I probably should. But, you know. Alright. So we have this extremely phallic looking building. Look at that boy. Alright, so we're going to set up our circuit right here, I guess. And then we'll probably just cover it up. So that way we don't have to look at it. Pretty ugly. Uh, so we got that. And we're going to lead it over here. And it's going to lead into... I guess we need to break this part up. So the main goal that we're going to make for this episode is that we're going to get the staff and farm done and it's going to be an absolute beast at giving us XP and we're going to get crazy enchantments, we're going to enchant our dog, we're going to enchant everything we can, and then next episode, we're going to kill a dragon. Probably that one right there since it's the closest. Or maybe that's a bad idea, maybe I should test it out on a dragon that I can guarantee that I could kill. Nah, I like to live I like to live life dangerously. We're gonna we're gonna do it on that dragon. Pop that over there. It's not gonna be the most pretty looking thing, but I mean this is all a temporary base anyways. Alright, so we got our water. It goes down there. We do need the signs that I left on the ground to despawn. That's unfortunate. Uh yeah, I need I need signs now. Dang it! I I looked at the signs too. I was like, hmm, do I need those? Nah. All right, so signs acquired. We're gonna pop one of these boys right here so that water doesn't get anywhere near being 
in danger. I'm going to break that block so it goes under there. So yeah, Zappin Farm is good to go. Um, should I leave any wood here is the question. I think no. Zappins shoot fire, so I think I'm good on that one. Definitely think I'd have to pass on that. Look at this. Get a nice little room with this obnoxious clicking. Boom, Zappins will spawn there. We're going to cover up that. And we can just kill him in there. And if we don't want him to get near us, we can also just place a block right there. And then drop stuff, drops their stuff in there. Um, it's not pretty. It's nothing nice to look at for now. But it's okay. Uh, so I need a hopper and a double chest now. What if we make this the power switch? <laughs> this is the most jank looking setup ever, okay? Wait, why is it not? The power switch has got to go here. Oh, that's even more jank. I, I spoke too soon. You know, at, you know, at this point, why, why, why even try to make it look nice? Like, look at it. I'm, I'm kind of speechless here. It just, it, it looks awful. So why not, why not just leave it the way it is, right? All right, so the outside looks bad, but I decide, you know, why should the inside look bad? I mean, I know this building's already got some weird style to it, but we have a nice brick floor. I guess um, I need to replace some of these walls, yeah. But for the time being, we've got our double chest, which needs to go, I think, right there, right? Yeah. So we've got our double chest. Goes down there. And we got our hopper, goes right there, and voila! We can access our chest poorly. I mean, it works. Oh boy, and we're cold. Okay, this thing is good to go though. Pretty excited, not gonna lie. We're gonna get lots of experience points, we're gonna test some books, and we're gonna get better enchantments for our armor. And we're also gonna enchant the dog's armor, because why not? Why not? And then, once we have beefy enough armorinos... Oh, there's a sign right there. Oh, wait, no, I threw that. Haha! <laughs> Small brain. Why am I still cold? Why am I thirsty? Why am I a cold, thirsty... Nerd. I'm a little nervous. I turn on. Oh, I hear them already! Oh, yes. Yes! Look at this! Oh, this is the best. You ready for an epic gaming montage? If you, too, would like to figure out how you can get tons of XP just by clicking your mouse, then I actually have a link in the description down below for the guide to make the sap and farm. Because I did cut out a couple of parts in the video in this episode, so it would be a little quicker. And if you do want to see a more in-depth description on how to do it, then I would recommend going to that video. I'm pretty proud of it. And yeah. Okay. Did, uh, did we get concrete? Is that what happened? No. Oh, this is nice. We're already level 27. Oh, that's nice. Only thing is, you get like super thirsty. Oh god, the Argus's. I forgot about the Argus's. Oh, that's a Scarlet Argus. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah, so they spawn Argus's whenever you uh do this. Okay, we got a we got a problem outside now. All right, ready? One, two, three. Go, 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 go. Oh, there's a lot of Argus's. That's why I didn't want it to be too close to my house. But I was also like, ah, eh, you know, it's fine. I swear I saw one inside my house. Alright. Um. I do have the jump height to take care of them, so. 
Whoa, 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 not cool. There's too many. Oh, there's too many. Okay, nope, not gonna, not gonna happen there. Too many Argy boys. Um, crap. I can't even turn this thing off because the Argus is. All right, one down. There's a green boy over there. This boy is throwing me. All right, before I. Oh, let me, let me inside. Let me inside. All right, before I continue, I need to make sure. Oh, he broke my leg. What a guy. What a guy. F's in chat for my leg. That's right, I have jump height. I ain't scared of. Oh. Oh, jeez. I ain't scared of you. My legs might be, though. All right, so this, this farm. Is great getting rid of the Argi or Argus is. Someone in my comments said Argi, and I I don't know if that's true or not. Cause technically, it's just a made-up thing, but we're gonna call it Argi for the sake of it. All right, is my lava still out? There's one chilling over there. It's cool. He can do his thing. Don't really care. Ooh, look at all the Zappin spines. So we need to make either a Paxel or a mining tool. There is a mining tool that I want. Um, and look at this. We've already got a ton of acid splashes. Lots of slime balls. We've already got all the slime balls we need for the time being. Just from that little bit of farming. So if I have enough blaze rods, actually, I, I don't. I can make magma, right? Also, mega winter time. So like magma is made from magma cream, which is just slime balls and that. So for the time being, we gotta get that because we're gonna start getting cold. What season, like how far into the season are we? Oh boy, um, I don't even have a lava bucket anymore. Oh jeez, okay, cold. Oh jeez, come on, don't. I'm, I'm already, mm. Guy. Come on now. I don't have any lava. It's interesting that those are still in there. Alright. Uh, we're gonna have to do this kind of quick. So, we're gonna make all of this into those. And we're gonna do risky and we're gonna make all of those into those. Make magma. Make those. Uh, and we need... Need string. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna die, am I? Aw oh, jeez, the hyperthermia! Hypothermia, it's same thing, doesn't matter. Uh it's really hard to think when you're constantly taking damage like that, okay? It's like super hard to think. All right, so we've got 12 of those, which is enough. To at least make a chess piece worm liner. It's not ideal. It's not what I wanted, but it's gonna have to do. Wait. Wait, do I have to make the cold one too? Oh, I'm so gonna die here. Well, actually not really. It's kind of just hurting my feet. The hyperthermia is hy hy hypo, hyper, hypo, hypo, hypo. Hyper is hot. Jeez. I know that. I just. God. Um. The constant damage makes it so hard to do anything. Uh. Aussie liner. Aussie liner. So I need this as well. I need cooling goo, which is from packed ice and slime. Uh, I don't have a lot of packed ice. Not a lot of packed ice. Um, okay, so those, those there. Actually, we're, we're good. We have an Aussie liner. Oh boy. Ideally, I'm going to need two Aussie liners. That way I can kind of take care of my temperature. Wait. Oh, it's because I'm an idiot. I could have just, this is how you craft it. Not the anvil. See, it's really hard, okay? It's really difficult. Alright, that, sh that should increase my temperature. It's really hard to focus, but I'm constantly taking damage. 
constant damage is not helping. Look at it. It's, it's breaking all of my limbs. Please tell me that's enough. Please tell me I have... You know, I could, I could hopefully make a second one, actually. Um, uh, focus, focus. At those, check. Because it's not enough yet. Oh, wait, it's enough to get out of hyperthermia. Big brain stonks. The slime was exactly what we needed. Zappin farm. Mwah, perfect. Oh, I'm an idiot. You can't put more than one on one piece of armor. I needed to make legs. What is wrong with me? It's okay. It's okay. That that can be used for a future set of armor, and I think one is enough for the time being. That I'm fine. Yep, one is enough. One is enough. I'm good. It's okay. It's okay. Dumb. That's just dumb. All of my limmy limbs are breaky broken because I'm dumb. Alright, so it's mega unfortunate that I made two identical Aussie liners when I needed leggings because my temperature could be perfect, right? Two is enough to basically balance most of your temperature issues almost perfectly. However, I was so distracted by the constant bits of damage I was taking that I panicked and made a duplicate. Um, I think I could actually make pants. Hold up. I do have these blaze rods and I do have more slime. See, slime is the key. That Zappin farm? Mwah, perfect, great. Big brain. Boom. Let's go. And now we have two sets of temperature adjusting linings, which is enough to keep your temperature at mildly discomfortable at max. Um, occasionally in very, very extreme biomes, which there's not many of, you do get cold or warm, but never enough to take hypo or hyperthermia damage. So we should be Gucci. So you may be thinking, wow, you're gonna you're gonna do amazing things in RLCraft. You got so many levels. You're wrong. There are so many uses for levels in this mod pack. It is absolutely absurd. There is the K menu where you can level up skills. There is the actual skill menu where you can level up different types of skills. Uh, there's tons of enchantments that you have to go for that are super rare. In the server that we play on, that I stream on, we have actually gone ahead and done... We've enchanted probably hundreds of books by now, maybe even over a thousand books. And there's still lots of enchantments we're hunting for that we have not gotten. Insane. Well, I'm getting hungry. When you're hungry, the entire game turns black and white, which is... Kind of terrifying. Oh, there's a Blight Boy! Ooh, Blight Boy, what are you gonna drop? Blight Zaffin level 2? Ooh. How come now it doesn't want to stop? I have reached the peak perfection number. The perfect level. A level that no man or god could transcend. And the farm's like, nah fam, now I'm working. You don't have to stop every 10 seconds now. Come get all these kills, boyo. Uh, Houston, we seem to have a problem here. Our, uh, chest seems to be full of zapping spines. Also, we got- look at this! We have 11 heart crystals from the Blight Boys spawning. Um, I really don't need that many spines. Um, acid splashes can be used on pets and equipment parts with matching elements. I don't have any acid pets. Um, I'm gonna make a quick chest just so I don't lose anything just in case I need it and then we're gonna go get enchantments although I don't there's a lot of Argus oh oh there's a specter oh I don't I don't know if I can take that thing yet I don't I don't know oh boy I guess I'm gonna have to oh god oh god it's gonna kill me it's gonna kill me it's gonna kill me Totally gonna kill me. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. It's totally gonna kill me. It is 100% going to kill me. Oh. 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 Stop. 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 Oh boy. 
Oh boy, no, don't come any closer, please. Oh crap. It's got so much health! Oh boy, Argus, you're not helping the situation here. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, come on, 6%. 6%, fight me, fight me, fight me. Come on, 0%, yeah! Suck it, buddy. Oh, I don't know if I should try to heal first or if I should go for the house. I'm so slow, dude. If another Argus is out here, I'm so dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh, please. Please. I didn't... I didn't know specters could, like, spawn like that. Look at my health! I didn't... I've never fought one in survival mode in an actual, like, game that I was playing, right? So, like, I fought them in survival mode when I had all weapons that I spawned in for the guide video. And I've never seen them in the server before. I've never seen one spawn. And we even have a Zaffin farm. That's... That is absurd. I should have eaten one of these Yeti meats to get resistance. That was kind of small brain. That is a ton of charges though. Like, wow. We're gonna have to do something with the Zaffin tails. We have a ton of Zaffin tails. Yeah, it's already it's already full again, just with Zaffin tails. I don't know why they dropped so high. I don't have any kind of like enchantment that increases drop rate or rarity of stuff. Maybe they're just common? I mean I didn't see that many drop in I don't know. It's weird. Alright, we got lots of levels. First things first. No. I say we can make at least one of these. Yeah, boy. Boom. Another heart. Nice. It gave me another head heart. That's something I desperately need because I'm always struggling in that category, apparently. Oh, man. I just saw a Morok. It just despawned, though. Let's take a second to look at how beautiful this snow really is, though. I cannot wait. Until I get a new GPU and I can make the game look even better. Is that a troll? What is that? That's yeah, a troll. Those things hurt. Unnecessarily. Alright. Need my water bucket. Check. Take our doggo out of the cold. And we're gonna go enchanting. Come on, doggo. Come on, boy. That was a good whistle. Totally good whistle. I can whistle pretty well. I just don't want to, like destroy everyone's eardrums. All right, so what happened to the fight? <gasps> Wait, what happened to my strength and vitality? Why is it gone? What? D did I lose it? Wait a second. Uh-uh. All right, well, this is going to give me prot three. It, it just gave me prot three. Hmm. I mean, it's better than nothing. Uh, we're going to enchant our helmet. Magic protection two. I don't think so. So we're going to need some book renos. I don't know why I keep calling everything renos, but I like it. Let's go with it. We're going to see what kind of books we can get. Flinging. Rash. Thunderstorm's Bestowment. What? Hold, hold up. What is that? Thunderstorm's Bestowment. One of the weather enchantments deals extra damage during thunderst- Oh. Yeah, no. I don't- I don't think so. Uh, economical. Not really trying to get that. <gasps> Lifesteal 4, and I'm breaking 3. That's going on the dog armor. That's the dog armor book. That's 100% going in the Dog Armor book. Uh, Respiration, no. Efficiency, four. Hello. Range. Bane of Arthropods, no. Advanced Thorns, I think I'm good. Blocking Power, no. Short Cast is trash. Protection, four and breaking, three. Yes. Okay. So, real quick. Diamond Wolf Armor. Um, 
So, can I enchant it on its own? Arc Slash? Bro, what is Arc Slash? Dude, yes! There we go. So, Arc Slash plus Unbreaking 3 in Lifesteal 4. Every time our wolf attacks something, he's gonna take the health away. Oh yeah, look at our little dude. He looks like a superhero. Look at his little face. Look at his face. Come on chat, make a cool name for him. Give him a cool name. Let me know in the comments down below a cool name. Oh man, that's dope. I'm excited. Moisturized. Okay, I'm not that excited. Calm down. Bling. Uh, I'll keep the protection one, but it's really not something I care much about. Destructive's kind of trash. Sharpen's kind of trash. Full speed. I'll take the efficiency. I could use it. Um, Smite is against zombies. Not a big fan. Power four. That's what we need for... Thorns too, huh? That's what we need for a bow. We're gonna make a killer bow that's going to destroy dragons. All right, we're officially under level 30 now. That's unfortunate, but um, this bow has already got legendary quality. However, you can make a long bow with three string, two diamonds, a handle, and two sticks. So handles made with string and sticks. All right, so we're gonna make a handle, and we're gonna make a longbow. Need two diamonds for longbow. I don't know, guys. Do you think? What am I doing? Do you think I have enough diamonds? Does it look like I have enough diamonds? I don't think so. All right. We got light plus five percent projectile damage. That's not bad. Uh, we are going to need agility twelve. That hurts to waste our levels on that. Um, Alright, so we're gonna give it power. So we got a power 4 bow. And then efficiency 4 is gonna go on this pickaxe for the time being. And we're gonna name him Diggy Boy. Since we use him a lot, I wanna at least be able to break things fast. So he's Diggy Boy. No, what about Diggy Dude? He's Diggy Dude because... It's illiterate. Yay, alliteration. Now we got a fast pick. Okay. And I'm getting a little more confident now in my ability to not die. Um, don't make me regret this. We're gonna we're gonna make this halberd. We're gonna start making it. Then again, if I put looting on it, I can't put advanced looting on it. But at the same time, looting would really help me. And if I get looting too, I could always throw that on there. So we're we're gonna go ahead and do it. Literally God. So we got looting too. Just tell me scope doesn't go on it. Okay, scope needs to go. Um. Oh wait, no, sweeping edge three is not what we want. We want swifter slashes. That's why it doesn't go on there. Do I not have swifter slashes? That's fine. We got Sharpness 3, Luck Magnification 2, Life Steal 4, and Looting 2. So it's already going to give us insane drops with loot. Um, it needs Mending. I kind of don't want to use it yet. It needs Mending. Uh, we also are going to need Arrows. We're pretty good. We've got Protection. We got crazy Protection. There's just one thing that does bother me. And that is, um, the dragon's fire, right? I'm gonna take one of those. So, we don't have any fire protection at all, and I don't have a dragon's eye. I really would like to get fire protection. And then we're set to kill a dragon. Ow! Oh, I got, I got a legendary diamond shovel! Nice! Alright, so I'm gonna go get some flint so we can make arrows, and I'm gonna get some more XP. And we're going to try to get fire protection, and we're going to try to get arrows for the bow. We can kill the dragon next episode. Alright, so I got my cool shovel that I used to get a couple stacks of gravel. 
well, two stacks, and I got 17 flint from it. I also found another place over there that's really close that I think is where the hound that keeps popping up, the boss bar, is located. You can always do that. But I did see this earlier when I checked the shovel. Efficiency 4. Dope. So we got an efficiency 4 shovel now. I would have liked to have fortune. Fortune would be amazing. Got a couple more chances at some levels here. But I should focus on the diamond chest pieces. Unfortunately, I'd have to make another Aussie liner, but it's not like Aussie liners are hard to make. And also, it's not like I can't afford to waste some- Ooh! Oh, it's got Meltdown, though! Meltdown sucks! Advanced Blast Protection? I don't- I don't think so. Efficiency 4! Mmm. I combine it with another thing and get Efficiency 5 on something. I just need one level. See, this is really unfortunate because Meltdown grants you a chance to explode if you're attacked. The explosion doesn't harm you, but damages the armor severely. Even if we have Mending on it, that's not... That's not good. Um, I guess... I could technically get it off. I no, the disenchantment table would break it. I'd lose that strength and vitality is basically gone. I mean, I could see how meltdown is, how bad it is, but I I don't know, man. It's, it seems like it's not worth the risk. Uh, for the time being, I could combine this with unbreaking three, though. Make unbreaking three protection three. And we're going to go with the theme here and call he him Defendi... What should be called? Defendi Chest? Defendi Chest. That's what we're calling it. Defendi Chest. That extra level is worth the stupid name. So we got... Jumpy Boots and Defendi Chest. <laughs> it's time to stop. Hey, so I got enough uh, Heart Crystals to make another... Heart of Health. Boom! Moving up in the world. Alright, so let's see if we can get more shovels. I mean, I don't have enough- I don't want to waste the levels yet on getting, um, on leveling up the disenchantment table, because I think that's- yeah, that's eight levels of this. That's expensive. We're not doing that. I take some- whoops. Take some lapis. And we're going to see if I can get fortune on this. Versatility? No. We're, we're not doing that. Oh yeah, efficiency 4. I have to do that. Efficiency 4 as well? Mm. Wait, what, is, what does tunneling do? <gasps> Fortune 3! Yes! Let's go! Dude! Let's go! Okay, hold up. Big brain moment, you ready? Take that. Combine it with that. Efficiency 5, Tunneling 1, Fortune 3, Legendary Diamond Shovel. And we're going to call it The Chosen One. Not The Chosen One because of the YouTuber that also did RL Craft. The Chosen... That's expensive. Oh, man. Oh. Okay. Jeez. Nice. But yeah, The Chosen One because this shovel has been chosen to take the burden of all this gravel. Let's see. Oh, it, oh, it prints, it prints flint. Oh my God. How many do I have now? 31, dude? What? Moving up in the world. Delete, 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 delete. Oh man, that's so juicy. All right, look at this, ready? Boom. The thing instantly deletes the gravel, and it just prints flint. I need a polarized stone. Alright, we got tons of flint. I think what's holding us back now is the feathers. That's problematic. I've only got five feathers. Are you for real? I... Wow. I have, like, this super efficient system now to get one thing that I need, and now I'm stuck needing something else. That's super unfortunate. So we're going to put the flint in here. 
with the arrows. Um, we're going to take those arrows. And we're going to put them in with this boy. So we got our... We've got arrows kind of coming. Um, I just need to get feathers. So I need to go around killing some chickens. Um, I really would have liked to have fire protection. But we just blew all of our levels on that... Which was admittedly pretty dumb. And I've got another efficiency 4 enchantment, but I'm going to save it for now. I could combine it to make an efficiency 5 pickaxe, but it's kind of not necessary. Did I lose some of that gravel? I had like 3 stacks of gravel. Where did, where did the gravel go? Come to think of it, this thing... Wait, what does tunneling do? Hold up, what does tunneling do? Oh no. Let's, wait, let's you more blocks at once. I don't know what that means. I'm assuming let's you break more blocks. I don't know. Anyways, we are good now. We've got, we've got our diamond longbow and we got arrows. We're gonna get more arrows in the next episode and we are going to go and kill a dragon. I don't have fire protection, but I think we're still good enough to take him. Um, we'll see. Oh, look at that gross water, that water bar glitch when you go to F5. It's disgusting. But yeah, if you do like this series so far, do not forget to like and subscribe. It really helps the channel out. And we are about to hit 2,000 subs, guys. I love all of you. Anyways, this has been Pain Domination, and I will see you all in the next video. Peace.